Hey, Bart Miller Hero Cycling Strong 2014 Interbike. We found these lights yesterday, but we kind of went out last night to see how bright they were, kind of play with some other lights. The reason I'm trying to find the right light right now is I want to do some really cool mountain biking outdoors and kind of through the night, but also a race called Rockwell Relay. Now, Rockwell Relay is a 24-hour race that you do, but when you're on a bike and you're going 30, 40 mile an hour, the problem is you can't see real well, and people don't think about that when you're trying to go fast on a bike. So if you don't have a light that's bright enough to get out there, you're in trouble and it really slows you down, and it's really dangerous. So for me, it's the right light for that race for this year. So we had some other lights out there. You'll see them in other reviews that we're doing. But the light that we liked the most was from Glowworm, and they have this light called the XS. Now, they have a couple ways you can mount these different lights. We also use this uh, X1. It mounts on the helmet. For me, I just on the helmet I move, I like it, but don't love it. This right here, being able to mount it on my bike where I, I'm right there, absolutely love that. That it just fits my personality, what I like to do. So, got this mounted. We were mounting it last night, and the cool part is, it snugs up really, really easy. Nice lever to cinch it up with. Very convenient to get on and off the bike. So it's not like you're using this every day. I'm not. Therefore, being able to get it on and off is a big deal for me. Also, it was really nice and secure and adjustable. The battery length was really good. So it turned out perfect for us. But we wanted to get an expert to walk us through the product. He's got several things here. So we asked Bruce to come in. This light is super bright. I don't know what they've done, but one cool feature on it, it's got a little switch. Put the switch, you're able to touch it real easy instead of having it right on the product and on the back trying to get to it. So, Bruce, walk us through everything. Right, so what we've got here is got the, uh, the XS, which is a true 2200 lumen light. Uh, designed and engineered 100% in New Zealand. And I'm a, uh, I'm a mountain bike aficionado, so I love mountain biking. So yeah. I basically designed this light for myself. Oh, cool. Um, I work with, with a group of uh, mechanical and electronic engineers, mm -hmm. and they put some really cool uh, electronic wizardry in the back of this light. And that's why we can make it so small, so high powered, and um, in such light weight on such a, uh, on a small light. Um, we add the nice CNC mount, which I talked about Very before. Nice. And um, with mountain bike lights, uh, the mounting system is the holy grail of the it lights. Is. And if you can get the mounting system right, then and you've, you've got a really good, simple, high-powered product, yep. you've, got a, you, you've re really got a winning product. I agree. And so what we've done here is just created a really simple, easy-to-use product. We custom design our own optics in the front here. Um, everything's sourced from the highest quality suppliers and assembled in our own facility. Um, it truly is one of the best lights we feel on the, on the market as far as a bar light is concerned. Yeah. And you add the remote switch, which is optimized for a 760 mil bar. Yep. And um, we absolutely love this light. It's now the most popular uh, selling light in our range yeah. in the US at the moment. Oh, great. As a combination light with our X2. Uh -huh. Alternatively, the X1, which you tested last night as yep. well. But as a bar light, Nothing on the market at the moment beats this one, yeah, we, we believe. Yeah, first class. Also, I really like how you've done the batteries. So the battery right here, if you look on here, it gives you actual ratings. So you're not guessing if the battery is almost dead. And that is super cool because the other system that I used doesn't have this on here. So you're yeah. always wondering, oh shoot, when am I gonna actually run out or do I have to run in and charge? So during a race like Rockwell, uh, you, you'll switch this light maybe to somebody else. They may already have one, which is ideal, but if not, you'll switch this and they'll have to wonder if they've got enough battery or not. And we actually had that battery die on us in halfway through the race, which really sucked. We did have another battery. Uh, we got it on the bike, but it slowed us down in that situation. So having that on there, super great idea, very innovative. Uh, I also think the switch, very innovative, uh, like that idea a lot. So. Really great light. Um, I have not heard of them until I got here to Interbike, but check it out. Give these guys a real look because I think you'll be very impressed with how well and how bright this light is. The visibility last night was amazing. The distance we could see, how fast you could go with it, and everybody in the group really enjoyed that. So uh, kudos to you guys. Thanks a lot for uh, helping us, and we'll, uh, we'll keep you in tune on some more of the things that we're doing. So. Interbike 2014 and uh, Glowworm Lights. Go look them up. Check them out. Where can they find you at? Uh, Glowwormlights.co.nz. Lights spelled L I T E S. Okay, excellent. Yeah, yeah.
We'll look forward to uh, seeing what you guys think about it. Make comments below. Subscribe to the channel. Stay tuned. Yeah, thanks, guys.